by their SharePoint enthusiasts. With SharePoint eSignature, you can quickly and securely send PDF documents for signature to people inside and outside your organization. You also have a digital audit trail, which can be used to verify the authenticity of documents and transactions. SharePoint eSignature is a native Microsoft feature designed to streamline the process of gathering signatures directly from SharePoint document libraries. I'll show you how to enable it and how to use it. To begin, you have to create a resource group within an Azure subscription. So navigate to the Microsoft 365 Admin Center, click on Settings, Org Settings, Pay-as-you-go services, then on Syntax services and connect billing to your Azure resource group. Next click Settings, Documents and Images, and finally eSignature. Enable SharePoint eSignature and select SharePoint sites that are allowed to have eSignatures. Optionally, you can also enable Adobe Acrobat sign and DocuSign. Once you've set up SharePoint eSignature, you can create signature requests for your PDF documents. Here is how. Open a PDF document from a library. Click the Request Signatures button, then add the people who need to sign the document. You can send the request to multiple recipients. If needed, you can also send the signature request to yourself. Choose where the recipients need to sign, you may also want to provide a placeholder for an initial and a date. After selecting the necessary fields and adding a message, send the request. The recipients will receive an email with a link to sign the document. Once all parties have signed, the initiator is notified. It's not complicated. SharePoint Signature offers a convenient solution for basic signing needs within the Microsoft 365 ecosystem. It does lack the extensive features available in the specialized eSignature tools like DocuSign and Adobe Sign. They offer more field types, but SharePoint eSignature can be cost-effective, charging only $2 per signature request once the free tier expires. DocuSign and Adobe Sign can cost $15 to $45 per user per month. So for smaller businesses who don't often need these signatures, say only five signatures per month, it would only cost you $10, $2 per signature. And because it's pay as you go, there's no expensive subscriptions. Also, the signing process is fully integrated within SharePoint, so there is no need for any third-party tools. Finally, documents stay within your organization's SharePoint environment, ensuring compliance and security. Okay, there are a few limitations. It lacks the advanced features of DocuSign and Adobe Sign like signing order, extensive customization and workflows. Only signatures, initials and dates can be added to the documents. And you need external sharing enabled if external parties need to sign. But SharePoint does support these signatures with DocuSign and Adobe Sign, so businesses can still use it as the starting point and benefit from the advanced features of other platforms. Just bear in mind, those services require a subscription.